Andrew! Andrew! Please, you are awake. You have to take me to my father. I will, my prince. But I need to have you dress up first. Because the king is with a guest. Andrew! Oh no, he's not a guest. You have to take me to my father. Prepare me now. Yes, my friends, right away. <sighs> Greetings, the queen mother. Greetings, my friends. Son, you already awake? Yes, mother. How was the night? Fine, mother. Uju knows how to make you look right here tonight. <laughs> you look so beautiful. Thank you, sir. Where are you going? I must see my father, His Majesty. There's something pressing I need to discuss with him. Something pressing? An hour. Let's go.
Brother, hey, brother GJ, um, let me call you back, okay? Hello, G. How are you? I feel better and stronger. Oh. Oh. The day is bright. Of course. It is. And promising. But I can feel a dark cloud moving around. I can feel the season of pestilence. But I don't know when and why. My prince, my brother. Eloji, what are you talking about? For crying out loud, you sound mysterious. What are you talking about? How do you mean a dark cloud hovering? Anayo, let's go. Eloji, you did not answer my question. How do you mean that cloud? What, Your Highness? Have you seen anyone that you want to marry? That is exactly what I was telling you. She's the daughter of Edward, the primary school headmaster. That will be touchy. Because the headmaster has only one daughter. That is her. She's the one. She's a good girl with good moral behavior. She will make a good wife to you, that I believe. You know you have eyes in good ladies. Don't know who you can say that again. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> Your Majesty, Prince Lochu waits outside. Let him in. Yes, Your Majesty. Son, what brings you to the throne room? Father, I must speak with you. Alone. Whatever you have to say, go ahead and say it before we know. He is your uncle and that makes him family. The prince knows that already. But if you want me to leave you too, that is to say the thing you want to discuss with the Majesty is secretive. I can leave. It's okay. You can stay. Father. Please, don't do it. The maiden you are planning to take as your wife. Please, don't do it. How do you even know that I intend to take another wife? I have never discussed this with anyone except your uncle Onowu just now and he has approved of it. Ilochi, how did you know about this secret? Father, I am begging you, please don't do it. Not for anything, but for the good of this kingdom and the royal household.
Oh yeah. You look upset. What is it? I will tell you when you return. Well then, I am running late when I return then. Your Majesty, Queen Janet is at the entrance. Let her in. Hello, how are you feeling? Oh, your Highness. Are you leaving already? Yes. It has been long since he came around. Highness. How are you doing, my dear? Bad. So bad. You gave me a bounced check. That is not true. I was humiliated today in the bank. And that was not funny. Do you have the check with you? Let me see. I'm sorry. I forgot to sign the back of the check. But you should have given me a call the moment they rejected the check at the bank. Spend the night at my chambers. Okay, Your Highness. Excuse me. This prince, this young prince, what are you? Are you a clairvoyance? But it doesn't look like one. This is terrible. Doji, tell me the truth. This rumor I'm hearing, tell me, is it true? What rumor are you hearing? I don't get you. Is it true you are going to become His Royal Majesty's third wife? I thought you said you loved me. What about the love we share for each other? I thought we have a future together. Please. Look, Pascal. Listen. I love you. With all my heart. But look at you are not ready for marriage, are you? I am a woman. I am not getting any younger. Can't you see? Dochi, you know I am working hard to make a living. 
You know I am working hard to be better than the way I am today. Please, don't marry him. Wait for me, and I'm going to treat you as my queen. Please. I'm sorry, Pascal. You have a long way to have an empire, but I will rule as a queen. Tochi. Dutch, why is your face like this? What happened? Papa, is it not Pasca? Pasca will not let me be in this village. Am I the only one in a relationship? Papa, Pasca is harassing my life. He will not let me be. Is that why your face is like this? Damn you, Genevi. Pasca, I am the one that gave you permission to marry Iwagumba. Because that's the future you duly deserve. Papa, please. Oh, please. Talk to Pascal. Because I'm going to give him the insult of his life. I'm going to insult him to the extent that you will never forget it. What insult, Pascal? Eh? Give him the insult of his life. Bia, 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 bia. What do you want? Leave us. No. My servant is going nowhere. Say what brought you. Leave us. Now, why are you here? I don't like you. And I was never in support of your marriage with my father. But right now, you are the only one. The only one that can save this royal family and my father. Now you are confusing me. What are you dragging at? My father is about to take another wife. What? <sighs> and why are you telling me this? I have this feeling that the season of locust is about to begin in this palace and the feasting will be perilous. It will be massive. It will be massive. Anna, you My friends.
So this is the time you are coming back since morning you left this house. Eh, Jessica? No, Mama, I was looking for dry wood. May that dryness kill you, dear. Who are you deceiving? You are coming back from a man's house. Eh? Yes! No, Mama, I don't go anywhere. Get out of my sight! Useless pig. Welcome, my daughter. Think you are going? Where do you think you are going? Spend little spam, eh? Come on, go back and take your bets before you enter my house. Get out of my sight. Go back. Grandma, mm -hmm. don't you think that you are being too harsh on that girl? She is trying to impress you as much as she can. But you don't seem to value her efforts. Be careful. If you don't want me to eat this food in peace, say so, so I better leave it for you. You are calling me Oka. It's okay for not your name. All I'm saying is that you should take it easy on her. She is also your daughter. She's not my daughter and will never be. Never! Never! She can't be my daughter! Your Majesty. Is it true that you are planning on getting a dead wife? Who told you that? Who told you that? Oh, he did. He told you. So it is true. It is true that you are planning on getting a dead wife. Your Majesty. What for? Is it that I'm not enough for you that you are planning on getting another one to share you with me, or what? Oh, shut up your mouth, you psychopath. What were you expecting? After you married him, knowing you fully well that I am his wife of so many years, were you expecting him to be faithful to you not to take another wife? You lie. Would you stick your tongue out of my affairs? Your opinion is not needed. When I need one, I will call for it. Well, Janet, I am the king. The king of ancient Amerika kingdom. I am a living monarch. And on that premise, I am entitled to marry as many wives as I want. Oh, really? So this is all you have to say to me? Okay. No problem. I can see that this palace has become too cold for us all. Go ahead, get the medal, and we shall see. What way are you going to? Are you blind? I believe you are enjoying this. For 30 years I have been married to you. I have never a day raised an objection to your words, nor alter any of your decisions. Now look at it. The almighty king, Agumba, is now being tossed around and threatened by an ordinary maiden. All for what, your majesty? Hello, hello, hello. Uh... Can somebody bring me up to speed as regards what is going on here? Elochi. The answer you seek is one that will gladden your heart and harden your fathers. Why it rain down misery on everyone. 
dare you talk to me like that? Like that. Like that. How dare you talk to me like that? The answer you seek, my son, lies with the father. Ask them. Than the ocean, higher than the mountains, oh beware, I'm to leave a melebano. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one oh beware, I'm to leave a melebano. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains, oh beware. I'm to leave the Melody. Yes, girl. Yes, girl. Wake up. Papa. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm, thank you, Papa. Mm -hmm. yeah. Eat something. Mm -hmm. Then you go inside and rest. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Has she forgotten? I told her she would spend the night in my chamber. Who is there? God! Your Honesty! Yes, Your <laughs> Send one of those guys to go and fetch when you get it. Yes, Your Honesty. What do you want? Tell him Mr. Kansanis wants to see her in his room right now. Tell his majesty that my mistress will be with him. But not this moment. She's taking a bath and after that, I'll prepare her for the night. She will come and be with his majesty. Alright then. I hope she gets back on time before the king comes by himself. What happened today? You were upset all the day. At first, your father gave me. Uh, the, 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 the king of Abeke and Shipkeeper. Yes, my father. Well, he gave me a bank check. It's for his own letter that he banked today. For me to get back here and learn to mistake another wife. Then you became jealous. You are jealous he's taking another wife, whereas you are. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> and where are you going? <laughs> no. Go and tell Queen Janet that if she keeps me waiting for the next minute, I will punish her according to the royal law. There won't be need for them to your hands. Leave us. Your Majesty. said I won't grace my husband's bed tonight, Your Highness. 
Why are you sending a mess servant to fetch me as if I'm a call girl? I thought you were angry with me because of what happened earlier today. Yes. I was angry. I was so angry. But that cannot stop me from fulfilling my marital obligations. My husband. Right? I am fine. You can go back to your room. The night is still far and dark. Oh no, my friends. I'll have to stay here to watch you sleep. I am not feeling sleepy anymore. I am ordering you. I'm sorry, my friends. I will have to disobey you this time. To watch you sleep, please. Okay, fine. Can you just sit and stop making me feel uncomfortable? My father, the king, already has two wives. What will he benefit from taking more wives? Aside the financial burden, do you people even consider the effect of polygamous homes? Prince hmm. Ilochi, you are still a child. And you will not understand the ways of our father. Your father, the king, who is my brother, is not just a king, but the king of American Asian Kingdom. He is free to marry more than ten wives. I know, Uncle, but please, you have to talk him out of this world. Because the rain. The rain that is coming will be salty. Here you confuse me again. 
I have noticed you usually say things that are not real and yet to be. How do you usually know of them? Especially, who told you your father is about to take another wife? I just know them. Tell me, are you a clairvoyant? <laughs> Uncle, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Since you don't know, I am sorry there is nothing I can do. Your father is the king, and the kings does what they want. Stop. My prince, uh, do you know them? Should I go fetch them? No. Let's go. Your mother, you will soon be back. Please, while you wait, let me offer you some drink. Ah. That will not be necessary. Mm. Do you have any idea where she went to so I can send my guards to go and fetch her immediately? Don't you wait, 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 don't you and next time I see you anywhere around her, the story will not be the same. Now get out of my presence. Get out! I've heard you, Your Majesty. I'm sorry for the incident. It will never happen again. It better not happen again. Go no, no, no. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one no be way. I'm no family by you. A total of 1,000 naira goods. If you like, drop it somewhere. Go about following men. If you come back to this house without selling this thing, you know what I can do. Of course, you know me. Mama, I, I, I am. You are what? You are hungry. Come on, carry it. 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 Why I'm trying to play a motherly role to accommodate you, foolish and useless girl. Girls are so wicked. They are so wicked and heartless. Eh, now? So, after everything you've done for her and her father, they still have the mind to treat you in this manner. Mwan Diego. Fear women! I love that girl. I love her. Pascal, oh. I know you love her. But listen to me. You have to let her go. She is the poison that will kill you. Yes, she does not deserve you. You have to let her go. Let her go. Non so. So you think it is that easy to let her go? It is not. Can't you understand? Pascal, I understand. 
I know it's not easy. But let me get your point. Are you trying to fight His Majesty over a girl? Huh? You know that is a suicide mission. Uh -huh now, it's not possible. If you are tired of living, Pascal, go in there, take a rope, and hang yourself. Uh -huh now. And so, you will not understand. Have you fallen in love before? Have you fallen in love before? Apple, I love Apple, that girl. Apple love, Ijeogu, love Gabata. Um, okay. Ijeogu, now that we have fixed the date, inform your king's men, because I will be living with her on that day as my bride. <laughs> Igwe, you have nothing to worry about. <laughs> um, my dear, make sure you use that money I gave you and get yourself some new clothes. You must start dressing like Iwagumba's bride. You know, exhibit some royalty in your dressing code. All right? <laughs> Thank you so much, Your Majesty. Okay, you're welcome. I will do as you said. Igwe, I'm going now. You'll live forever. Thank you. Hi. <laughs> What happened? Your Majesty, she just crossed the, 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 the canal and I almost hit her. Go and see if she's hurt. <laughs> Young lady, why do you run in front of the car? Do you want to die? I'm sorry, I, 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 this is your car. Will you pack up this and leave this place before the man has to get here? Young girl, what happened? I am sorry, your majesty. I didn't see your car coming. I, I was it trying to... enough. Why is a beautiful young maiden like you hawking on the street when you should be in school? It's okay. Stop crying. I'm sorry about last night. I shouldn't have laughed at you. You deserve to be happy. I'm sorry too. I shouldn't have disrespected you in that manner. I'm sorry for walking out on you. Forgive me. Well, then that makes us even. <laughs> oh, yes. Um, I don't know about you, but I'm free. I don't know if you're busy with anything at the moment. No, not at all. I have nothing doing at the moment. Just playing with my phone. Well, then why don't you go out and play some games? The palace is actually boring. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I wonder what is going on. Everywhere is quiet. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm game. Let's go keep some hold up after you. Open your door.
<laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, okay stop. Oh. It's your You don't like him. He seems to me like a dark shed of mystery. Well, he's a nice guy. Uh, I, 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 I think when you get to know him, you'll like him. He has a good heart. He doesn't like me either. He said it himself. Do you think he knows we're seeing each other? Well, you see, as a matter of fact, no one of this palace knows anything about us except for. Oh, yes. You did, right? Nobody knows anything. But wait a second, are you asking this question because of what he said the other day? Yes. And he even said it before everyone. Well, it was something said out of anger. Yes, I'm sure he did not mean it. Oh, yes, he never meant it. And, um, he did not say we are seeing each other like we are sleeping with each other. If he had said such a thing before my father, my father would have my head on a platter. Oh, come on. Let's continue with the game. <laughs> Me too. Huh? Yeah. How can you say pick two? Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. No, 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 I'm not telling you to pick two right now. Pick two. It's okay. Well, PJ, stop crying. You will take me to that your stepmother. No, no, your majesty. Don't worry about it. You're going to be fine. Uh, work well. Your majesty. Drive straight to her place. Let me see that Jezebel that will subject this Nubian beauty to slavery. You'll be fine. Seriously, I have been thinking. Mm -hmm. Papa, seriously, I have been thinking. Mm -hmm. I mean, how would they cry out Pascal? Yes. Considering the fact that he has done a lot for us in the past. Papa, I I think we, we should just compensating like a payout you know at least for that money that Igwa Gumba gave us mm -hmm. let's give him some money as a payout you understand knowing fully well that we do, you don't have anything again to do with him you know I didn't care right my daughter I mean that case I will have to see him tomorrow, first thing in the morning. Okay. But that will be the last time you talk about him in this house. Oh, come on, Papa. 
She don't have to worry. You know how much I want to be a queen of this land. <laughs> you know how much I, 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 I crave for royalty. Can I want to marry King Agumba. You can see that again. Yes, to change my style. <laughs> but you should have it at the back of your mind that this is determination. And you have to work it out. But let me tell you something. Determination without faith is dead. <laughs> Papa, trust me. Uh -uh. My determination is the key. Abby? I'm determined, Papa. Uh -uh. Please change your yeah. I know what you can Let do. Let people know about our statue. Yeah, I think village. you are talking. At least we'll change this place. Yes, as a royal thing. <laughs> Headmaster, do you know you are very wicked? Yes, you and your daughter are wicked and evil. I remember when the government did not pay you for 18 months. It was I who made sure that you and your ungrateful daughter had something to eat. I did all sorts of menial jobs just to feed your ungrateful souls. And you're here telling me rubbish. Pascal. Pascal. Don't make it look that difficult. Yes, I realize you did all these things for us. But you should have at the back of your mind that it is not written anywhere that you must marry Tochi, my daughter. It is not written anywhere. My friend, my friend, my friend, listen. You must be very wicked and heartless at the same time. Eh? You are very wicked. No, sir. I will appreciate you stay out of this. Because it does not concern you in any form. It has everything to do with me. Pascal, my friend, here is still owing me some money of which he used to feed you and your hungry family. Um, Pascal, this is 12,000. I think you can use this and start something and move on because my daughter has moved on as well. Headmaster, I am not hungry and despicable like you and your beautiful daughter. I am not. You know what? Take your money and leave my house. Leave my house. But one thing is sure. A day shall come when judgment shall stand against you and your ungrateful, wicked daughter. Well, if you don't want the money, no problem. Notice I'm not considerate. I'll give you back the money. That's the money. Yeah, why you so? Move now. Move now. Come on, why you so? Oscar, calm down. You did the right thing by not accepting the money. Okay? And uh here -huh now. You did the right thing, bro. Let's go inside. Come here. Come here. Is that your duty post? Yes. I ask again. Is that your duty post? Yes. So you have nothing to do this morning? Huh? Well, since you have nothing to do, you know. And since you have nothing to do, let me give you girls something to do. You are going to kneel here until evening. Is that understood? Till it's evening. Stupid. What did you do to deserve this punishment from him? He thought of he was discussing. Was. Just discussing? Yes, your yes. Thank you. 
Why should we leave them under the scorching sun like that? And how dare you call me by my first name? How dare you? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my prince. But that is inhuman. It's inhuman to leave them under the scorching sun like that for all day. It's not right. Why don't you just look for another punishment and give them by leaving them under the sun? No, for your information, they are going to be under that sun until sunset. What? You heard me right. Oh, yes. Of course, of course. We're going to send it, yeah? Welcome, Your Majesty. What brings you to my lonely, humble house? You should have sent for me, eh? Instead of coming all the way uh, down here. Or has my daughter caused harm and brought shame to our dear kingdom, Ameke, Your Majesty? I don't have much to say to both of you for your callousness towards her. But I want to make this very clear. I don't ever want to see her hawking on the street again. Never. Else, I will severely deal with both of you. Okay, Your Majesty. I promise it will never happen again. Please. Remember what I told you. Think about it and get back to me. I am going to send two of my servants to fetch you in two days. I believe by then you must have given it a deep thought. Thank you, Your Majesty. I am start talking. Start talking immediately. Before I beat out the living daylight out from you. Ah! What did you tell his majesty about me? Take me back! Ah! I swear to God, I did not say anything. You didn't. You didn't say anything. We shall see. We shall see. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. Go be where come to live the belly by. Ooh. Ah. Ah. Who ordered this punishment on this week? My queen, it is Prince Patrick. He caught them discussing. And what? Now, stand up and go back to your duty post. What's that? Can't you rush? Oh, take her inside. Take her inside immediately. Oh, oh my God. Patrick, how could you be this wicked? Why did you leave all those servants under the scorching sun? Do you want to kill them? Well, I don't tell me you have released them. Yes, I have. 
And as I speak to you now, Chioma is unconscious. After being dried up by the sun, hope nothing happens to her. But how could you? No, how could you release them? But for crying out loud, I am the heir apparent to the throne of this kingdom. Are you trying to tell me that I cannot exercise my authority over my servants? Patrick, listen to yourself. Are you this wicked? I am telling you that one of the servants' life is at stake. Does that not mean anything to you? Let her die! All I care. She will tell me this now. She will tell me. My God. Oh my God. Why is my son this heartless? Your Highness, come and get you something to drink. I'm fine. You need it, Your Highness. You need something cool to calm yourself. I said I am fine! Tochi, all I'm saying is that have find a soft way to make Pascal understand. That's why I've actually tried for you and your father. Leaving him now is very bad. Huh? Look, I know Pascal really tried for me and my father. I know that. But <laughs> come to think of it, Pascal stole my virginity. Huh? <laughs> I've been paying him. We've been enjoying ourselves, so what are you even talking about? Tochi, sex is not everything. If it's actually what he wanted from you, he would have lived a long time ago. But that boy genuinely loves you. And I believe when you live with him, he will make you happy. You mean he will make me happy? Yes. I like happiness. Yes. You're talking about happiness? Wait, I'll come back. This is it. This is happiness. I mean, happiness. What do you think about this? Do she take a look at this? How did you get this beautiful clothes? Do you like it? Yes. It's beautiful, right? Yes, of course. I'm glad you like it. Well, Igu Agumba gave me money for shopping. And I shop for those beautiful clothes. Hmm? Mm -hmm. So this is what we call happiness. Tochi, happiness differs. Mm. And you know it. <laughs> Come on, my sister. This is what we call money is happiness. Don't be deceived by this L-O-V-E they call love. No, but for one man. He has kind of happiness. Tochi. Money is happiness. Don't you want me to be a queen of this land? Oh, you don't want royalty? Come on, girl. Yeah, who's that? Come in. Now, what is it? What, what, what do you want? Say it and leave. You and I have been fighting lately. I don't like it. I want us to stay.
Well, um, I think the only way we can stop is. is. Uh, see. The, the only way I think we can stop fighting is this. Oh, yeah. He got me angry today, no doubt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm out there. Well, did you hear that one of the wagons? Good day, Your Highness. What did I tell you about Tochi? What did I tell you about Tochi? I'm sorry, Your Highness. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah? Take him back there and give him 40 latches with the royal cane. Your Highness, please. I, I, I'm sorry. Take him! I'm sorry, Your Highness. I said take him! I'm sorry, Your Highness. Are you the only one in this village that knows my queen, Tochi? Please, Mama, can I come and do it? You are a fool. When I told you that there is no more food for you in this house, you thought I was joking. Hmm? So you expect me to use my hard earned money to be feeding your useless body? It will never, never happen in this house. Never! Please, Mama, I'm begging you. I'm hungry. Just go. Since it's obvious and you know that your father and your stepmother doesn't want you, why not marry me and rule this kingdom with me? Marrying me will be a major advantage for you. You will become my queen and you will be served with anything that you need as my queen. You stand a chance of gaining things that is royalty that other people will not have the opportunity. All you have to do is say yes. Oh no. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. 
Are you here to see my husband? No. I'm here to see her. It must be Jessica. Come. His Royal Majesty, King Agumba, first of Amekeki. Said I should ask you if you have given thought to his proposal. That is Majesty that has given thought to his proposal. I am going to marry him and become the queen of this land. Hmm. Thanks for being full of wisdom. I shall return at once with good news to His Majesty. The menace will be here to prepare you. Get ready. Oh no. My king. I have been thinking lately. I think I want to take two of them. I mean Jessica and Dochi on the same day. I want to marry both of them on the same day. <laughs> you are the king. You can achieve anything you want. Just give the order and it shall be done. But I don't want any lavish wedding. I want to do it our traditional way. <laughs> <laughs> Greetings, Your Highness. Mm -hmm. Greetings, Your Majesty. Greetings, sir. The antelope said to its offspring, Beware of the hunter, and he's gone. The offspring turned and asked, Can't we reason with the hunter, and he's gone? Father, that was how the antelope left with no offspring. Please, Father, don't bring her. Ilochi, if you were not my son, I will have you whipped. I will have you whipped real good. Don't you have respect for me anymore? I am sorry, Father. Shut up and leave my presence. I do not want to see you in these chambers anymore unless I summon you. Anayo. Your Highness. Take him away. Like I said, don't you ever enter these chambers. If I ever see him here again, I will have you beheaded. Take him away. What arrogance. What impetus. <laughs> yes, uh, yeah, I'm just... Who is the internet Who is the Why is no one listening to me? My prince, I don't know what you heard. But the truth is that you cannot tell the king what to do. Their decisions are usually guided by the gods. I did not hear anything. I saw it coming. And it is coming with speed. Now I'm confused. What is actually coming and what is coming with speed? And now you Death is coming.
Your Majesty, the lion and the benefactor of Ameke Kingdom. I present to you the beautiful medals that you have acquired. Tochi Edward, one of the most beautiful men of this land. Your Majesty. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. And Jessica Okafo, another red beauty of this land. <laughs> you are welcome. <clears throat> Thank you very much, Ono. My in-laws, you are all welcome to my enclave. Thank you, Igwe. Let me swiftly introduce my family, my noble family. <laughs> right beside me is the love of my life, my wife, the queen of this great kingdom, and her name is Sarah. Beside her is my second wife, my beautiful Queen Janet. And next to her is my first son, the heir to the throne of this great kingdom. And the last but not the least, my last born, Prince Ilochi. Once again, you are welcome. Her Majesty. Please, um, let us all go inside and celebrate this union. Please, 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 uh, please. Prince Patrick, have you ever been so sure of something, but no one believes you? She's here. I can feel her presence. No one can see her. And no one knows what is about to happen next. You know, Father is not happy with your actions, right? I know. You can go and be with them. I want to be left alone. And now you My You too. I want to be left alone. Since when? Since when did this nonsense start? No, for crying out loud, since when did my brother start losing his mind? Because it is obvious whatever he's saying does not make sense. He has always been like that. Prince Iluchi is a special child. He sees things before they happen. And are you? My prince. Are you by any means referring to my brother, Prince of Ameke Ancient Kingdom as a psychic? Not at all, my Prince. Far from it. I have been with the Prince since while he was a child. And I can categorically tell that he is special. 
My prince, please look into this. He might be telling the truth. Keep an eye on him. Keep a close eye on him. And make sure that all this nonsense he has been saying does not escalate in the palace. Is that what you see? Yes, my prince. Every day we talk about Stories of the things we want it's a beat that we forget Nobody knows tomorrow Please, Nai, can you help me talk to Jessica? Please talk to her on my behalf, woman. Now you are feeling guilty of what you have done against that innocence. I can remember cautioning you about your attitude towards that girl. But what did you do? I don't know what I was doing. I was only trying to make sure that she does not misbehave. Because you are not doing, please. You go and talk to her yourself. I know that guy never did anything wrong against you. She was trying her best to make you happy. Even when you stopped her. Ugoma, I can't wait to see that girl pay you in your own coins. Yes. Just go and tell her by yourself. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one of me way. I'm the reason to live by. Oh, Jimo, what have I done? I was only trying to make sure that she does not misbehave. Oh, look at me. Can you tell me what to say? Oh. Can you tell me what to do? Open or be away. Nothing is going on. I am fine, mother. Just that none of you is seeing what I have seen. My son, I know you don't like the maidens your father took as wives. That is what is bothering you. But there is nothing we can do about that than to embrace them. Aside from him being your father, he is also the king of this kingdom. And that gives him the right to pick as many wives as he wants to marry. I have heard you, mother. I will go and say sorry to him. Thank you, son. Good night, mother. You like her? I saw the way you were looking at her. Do you think she's more prettier than I? I don't know what you're talking about. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Don't do anything stupid. 
because my eyes are on you. Where are you going? My room. Stay with me. My father will be busy this night. Stay the night with me. I will be in my room. Good morning, Your Highness. Good morning, Father. Ah, son. I'm sorry. Good morning. I hope you've had a peaceful night's sleep. Yes, Father. You look worried. Father! Father! Father, you had better go out there and talk to that wife of yours. Oh, yes! You better go out there and talk to me if not for the fact that that girl is your wife. I would have beaten her black and blue. Oh, yes. Calm down, son, and tell me what happened. Father, there's absolutely nothing to talk about. Absolutely nothing to tell. Let her go out there and 
talk to her. If there is nothing to tell, then what should I tell her not to repeat again? The Majesty, why did you raise him so poorly that he does not know how to respect his mother? Good morning, Your Majesty. You? I left you out there. How did you get in here? Prince Patrick, you might be the crown prince, but you should also know that for as long as the king is alive, you have limited authority. And at that, you should know how to give respect to whom it is due. Father, you better talk to that girl. Talk to that girl, Father. Because I've had it up to here with her. That Don't... girl in question is my wife. She deserves some level of respect from you. Don't you ever refer to her as that girl. Not in my presence. But Father... I said, get out of my presence! Get out! The Majesty. She's the one. As a matter of fact, she moved in yesterday. I know she has moved on. But I'm not concerned about it. As a matter of fact, she is in the past now. And she should better remain there. I know she is in your past now. But I'm not happy the way the father treated you. Eh, now? I'm not happy the way they treat you at all. I'm not happy. Um, not so, my friend. The best form of revenge in this life is to be successful and be rich. Once you are successful, all those who insulted you will definitely come back begging. All those who ask, who are you, will definitely come back one day to ask you, how are you? So go ahead, money. I'm done. Let's, let's, let's go back. You go be one love. If you have money, you see love everywhere. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Chai, I feel for him. Eh? What she did to him is not good at all. And why is it not good? Why is it not good? <laughs> Are you saying that Tochi? Should have turned down his majesty just because of who? Because of him. Oh, wait, have oh. be wait. They promised each other love. Now, what happened to the future they were planning to do? Nah, meet another together? person has bought the land. On your ass, you go See, my dear, let me tell you something. You know. Love is good. It's very, very good. But in her love without money, it's a crime. Yes, I said it. It's a crime. You see, me should hustle. They should hustle and make money so that girls with lots of love will come for them. 
<laughs> See, my dear, I should still be so rude. <laughs> Never, 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 never marry a poor man. Never. Rude too. Rude too. Let me ask you one thing. Mm -hmm. Since you can't marry a poor man, mm. so who are you expecting to marry your three poor brothers? Bia, bia, bia. Amaka. I hope you are not trying to insult me. I'm a padle yangwa this morning. Don't even insult me. What is that? Insult you. How? Since all girls choose not to marry for love but for money. So, who are you expecting to marry your three poor brothers? Yeah, you are very, very stupid. I don't know what you, you are. You are you mad? Down. Wait, wait, wait. Are you stupid? Wait, wait. How dare you even refer my brothers as poor? Oh, you shouldn't even be making. Are you mad? So don't even try it next time, more. I bet Logan is kissing her head. Don't, oh, yeah, don't even insult me. Don't even insult me. I'm talking about him because I'm your. Your Majesty. Why would you allow that kind of a thing to happen? Why? What thing are you talking about? For crying out loud, Your Majesty. Jessica slapped Prince Patrick and you condoned her. Why? I know she's your wife, no doubt. But in age, Patrick is a senior. So she deserves to respect him. Good morning, His Majesty. Good morning, Her Majesty. Are you just looking up? I'm sorry, Your Majesty. I overflow. So I have to dress up to meet His Majesty. Once again. I'm oh, sorry. Please, my husband. Try and do something about this issue. Do not bring enmity and division of this palace. Jessica, why are you late? Am I late? <laughs> I didn't know. Okay, I am here. What is it? Seriously? Well, I will be brief. This palace has reputation and dignity. We all must uphold at all costs. We are co-wives of His Majesty, no doubt. And our number one priority is for us to make sure that His Majesty is happy in this palace at all time. And one of the ways we have to achieve this is for us to live in this palace with happiness and love. And most especially, to respect one another. I hope I have made myself clear. Ifoma. Told you. Ifoma here will be your handmaid. Treat her like a sister and she will serve you well. Of course, Your Majesty. I will treat her well. Okay. Jessica, Oga here. I don't need any personal servants. As a matter of fact, there are many serving in this palace, including those you kept as your personal maids. I mean, why not bring them out so that they can serve openly to all? Such insolence. How dare you talk to the queen? Son, I have not called you. Why not allow we, your mothers, to discuss like elders and stop interfering? That's okay. Hello. Call me that one more time, and I will reduce you. <laughs> I think this meeting is over. You got to wise up and stop being full of fuller. For goodness. Ah! Ah! That's an enormous
Good morning, Tochi. My queen, greetings. Good morning, my friends. How was your night? Please, I am sorry for what happened yesterday. Don't take it too personal, please. I am sorry. It's okay, my friends. I would have done the same if my father marries another woman while my mother is still strong and healthy. Thanks for your understanding. Anna, you. My friends. Take me out of here. Okay, my friends. How did he know I was coming behind him? I mean, how did he know I was here? That is the mystery we all are trying to understand about him. Yes. Are you saying that His Majesty said nothing when you reported to him of that little brat insolence? I reserve my comment. But one thing is for sure. I am going to make her stay in this palace unbearable. Oh yes. But why? Why would His Majesty support such an appalling act from that little girl? She is just a day old in this palace and she's like this. What will happen when she has stayed long? Fortunately, have a son for his majesty. Uh -huh. Probably a mere child for that matter. <laughs> that means she will send us all out of this royal palace. Oh, yes. No. I won't take that. I need to go and see his majesty and address things now. Because I won't take no sense from that little brat. Well, if my father cannot listen to me and act on it, what makes you feel he will take you serious? You are his son. And he expects you to take responsibility. But I am his wife. And he must listen to me. Excuse me. And you, when are you going to take this nonsense off your head? Your Majesty, this is good. You know they are always good for the raining days. <laughs> One thing I'm still trying to understand is how His Majesty usually spots these beautiful maidens when we in the chase can't find one to marry. Hey, uh, well, um, you all are welcome to this royal family. Thank you. <laughs> and we believe you are not going to serve His Majesty alone. Mm -hmm. But in fact, you know, sure. just like Her Majesty here, we said, she has been good to the people of this land, mm -hmm. to the king, to the royal cabinet. <laughs> <laughs> um, I promise I'm going to do my best to make you and this kingdom proud. <laughs> you are truly your father's daughter. Thank you. such beauty in you. Do you have a boyfriend? Join this 
We shouldn't be discussing case. Oh, I see. Because of your mistress, Janet, I presume. Well, you see, as a matter of fact, Janet and I, we have no future together because she is married to my father, the king. That's absolutely different from your case. I like you. Now you understand the reason behind my question. Do you have a boyfriend? Your Highness, for you to not forgive me, she finds out about it. She has been good to me and I don't want to offend her. Please, Your Highness. Well, I don't know about you, but I'd like to make you my queen when I finally ascend the throne. I like you. You know where to find me. Think about it. As this tradition demands, I will try my best in coaching them to the ways of reality. <laughs> Actually, I think I can do quite well on my own. I don't need anyone to babysit me. <laughs> Jessica, you will do well when you begin to mind the things you say in this palace. This palace is not for rude behaviors. Next time you repeat such unorthodox behavior, I will punish you severely. Your Majesty, please pardon her discourse. She is here to understand the true way of the queen. You are always right, Your Majesty. Please. Forgive her, In that case, with her, it is your responsibility to make sure she's taught all the ways of royalty in this palace. It is not just enough for her to put on the royal paraphernalia when she cannot exhibit any type of decorum in her disposition or the way she relates with other people in this palace. Enough is enough. Do you understand? Your Majesty, I will do so if she assents. But mm. wait, was that not Okafor's daughter? She is uh, the one uh, her late wife left behind at her tender age. I said it. This little timid and naive girl, is she not the one standing so bold in front of His Majesty King Agumba to utter nonsense with careless attitude as well? That's why it's always said that to know the true extent of a man's behavior, you will never know it when the man is poor, but when he's rich. Poverty has a way of humbling people. Yeah, you are right. Because uh, I wonder, when I went to see her uh, at His Majesty's order, I came back and asked His Majesty, is this shy girl the person you want to marry? And he said yes. Well, I know the kind of man His Majesty is. He will not give her the room to spread such noise before he cut it off from her. Bam. <laughs> huh? Hey, Iche. Hmm? We will see now. And so, I am thinking of moving over to the city to look for something to eat. Because obviously the way things are going now, I think I need it. You indeed need it. Hmm? A change will definitely do you a lot of good now. But um, where do you have in mind? Well, I'm thinking of moving over to Lagos. You know I have a lot of people there that I can stay with. At least for the time being. Then raise some money and look for my own apartment. It's okay. Oh, the man. Um, once you settle down, I will come and join you. That is the spirit. 
the hell now? But I have to go first. Hmm? Okay. Okay now. Bye bye. bye. That's right. Yeah, who's there? Yes, yeah, sir. Uh, who's there? Oh, oh, oh. My friends. Look at you. Come here, give me a Oh, yeah. How are you? I'm fine. My friends. Yes. Earlier today, what you said didn't mean it when you just want to have a taste of my body. I am a crown prince of Abeke Kingdom. My word is my bond. I love you. I've always loved you. Let me take care of you. Oh, I'm scared. I don't want my mistress to find out and get angry at me. Now, why don't we keep this a secret? A secret between you and I. And, um, until when I become king. And when I become king, we can tell the entire world of our relationship. After which I'm going to make you my queen. My queen. That's my girl. Oh? Are you no longer scared of your mistress seeing you here? Huh? Come on, get going before someone sees you here. Come on, come on, come on. Grab your stuff, get going. Oh. Hurry up, hurry up. They seem close. I saw them yesterday and today. And they are here again. Aren't she His Majesty's second wife? Yes. My lady, they are. Even rumor have it that they are sleeping together with Janet. Intention of marrying Prince Patrick when he becomes king. I see. Thank you. 
And what do you want from the Nuria family? My prince, why are you asking me such questions? I am your father's wife and that makes us family. I don't like you. And I will be glad if you leave this palace whenever you come. Well, I am not here for a spoiled child who is on the wheel and cannot help himself but have time for an auntie party. Oh my queen, you have to stay. You really do not have to talk to the prince in such manner. Do you seek to die? How dare you, miserable piece of trash, open your mouth to tell me what to do? Now kneel and apologize to me, then I will forgive you. I'm out of here. Let's take me out of here. Stop right there! This is your majesty. What happened, my love? Why are you crying? Tell me what happened. Your majesty, I'm sorry. I want to go back to my father's house since I'm not welcome among your children. <laughs> Tell me who amongst my children that is causing you pain. Tell me so I can ostracize him. <laughs> it's Anna, your Pentilochi's servant. What? Anna, your. God! Anna, your. My prince. I am sorry. Sorry about what, my prince? Who is my prince? His Majesty wants to see you. What did you say to my wife? Your Highness, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend her. You're a fool. In fact, you're a compound fool. Tell the guards to give him 40 lattes of the royal king. Yes, Your Highness. Take him out! <laughs> Thank you, my daughter. God bless you. Insane. Honestly, and you continue to receive more favor. Insane. Amen. Uh, <laughs> um, Papa, just like I said before, mm -hmm. do not wait until you come to the palace to request whatever you want. Mm. All you have to do is to write it down on the list. Whatever you want, just write it and say to me, and it shall be delivered to you. Eh? Yes. Do yeah. not wait for me to come to ask you what you need, Papa. <laughs> yeah? Because your daughter is a royal majesty. And yeah, no. And as a matter of fact, if you go this house, this house, I want to pull it down and build you a home. Eh? Yes. There is a difference between a house and a home. Okay? You mean you restructure this house? I want to pull it down. This house does not be fixing the high royal majesty, Papa. By then, you might have gone to your family house. Why oh, yeah. have restructure this place? Huh? Yes, that is why you have your daughter in the palace. Uh -huh. I'm a queen, Papa. You don't get it. You want to end it. All the same. Thank you so much. Yes, hmm? my daughter, as you rightly pointed out, I'll come to the palace when I need anything. Eh? Write it out. Mm, please. Send it to my maid. She's here. It's her duty. But you have to get to the good books of the crown prince and the queen as well. I like she's a very good woman. Yes, she is. And as for the prince, 
Don't worry. Huh? I have a plan. Plan <laughs> what? <laughs> yes. Hope it's a good one. Calm down. Take it one step at a time. You don't you trust your daughter to it? I know. Don't you <laughs> trust what I can do? I trust. <laughs> it was becoming down, Papa. Hmm? Take care. Yeah. Mwah. Yeah. Mwah. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. I'm driver. Let's go. Amaka, who am I seeing? Hmm? Hmm, indeed. <laughs> what was that for? The partridge thinks itself a peacock, but the pigeon urges its own. Roots, I do not have any problem with you. But you just insulted me. Not just me. You just insulted the throne of this land. Well, I shall visit you on this insult. Not just you, but your entire family. Ta! What can my chair go on there? You the shameless gold digger. How dare you? Um, it's, it's okay. Okay? Well, Amaka, we shall see, okay? Okay. Do have a wonderful day. All right. All right. Bye. Driver, <laughs> let's move. Hope you are ready to face and throne. Let me tell you something. I don't know what you are, but I am not here for you. Be wise and stay clear of my path. I actually had a, a slight headache, so I decided to take a nap. Oh, yeah. How are you? I don't know if I am fine or not. This whole palace is becoming so boring. What is happening? Oh, wow. Uh, come on, just say you miss me. <laughs> I said, I should have said that. 
I wouldn't have if Gladys is around. She took permission to go out and get some stuff for herself. Huh. So, I'm it's, all alone. That's so nice of you, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, that's my girl. You know what I mean? I know. Okay. Hey, come on. Come on. <laughs> wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. You know what I want? Oh, Daddy, my lady, are you all right? I'm fine, my lady. Why are you repeatedly sighing? What is wrong with you? Please forgive me. No. You know you are not all right. So don't even try lying to me. Tell me the truth. Anything bothering you? I'm fine, my lady. Please believe me. Right. If he says so, then shut up. Say no more. Do that thing right. Okay, my lady. Do it right! I'm sorry, my lady. Hey, your Highness! Oh. Your Highness. Oh, you are Tochi, right? Yes, Your Highness. Mm. I'm glad you remembered my name. <laughs> Why would I remember your name for crying out loud? You're my father's third wife and a member of the royal family. Wow, I'm flattered. And I'm so, so happy that you think highly of me. Ah. Well. Will I be asking for too much? I wish to invite you for a meal in my quarters. I want to prepare a special meal for you. I'll come. Well, uh, let's see if I have the chance. I'll come. That was the first time of experiencing bedwetting. How many years have I been married to you? Have you ever experienced it before? No. Uh -huh. But 
what might be the reason. And that thing I saw in that dream, it was right there in the room when I woke up. Do you think it has something to do with it? There was nothing in that your dream. You're only letting your imagination run wild. Yes. You might probably be right. I have never been that scared like I was in that dream. Need to wake up. <laughs> what are you saying? <laughs> No, really, uh, no, I was not expecting that. Uh, not at all. <laughs> okay, fine. We did then visit your royal parents. You did. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> all right, now I order you, as the second queen of this kingdom, to visit my palace. <laughs> Take this. You are driving me today. Hold on. I'll give her three okay. Are you deaf? I said you're driving me today. She is going nowhere. Says who? Says I. Queen Janet. She is my servant, not yours. So you have no right to send her on an errand. Did you get that? I remember they offered you a servant, but you rejected her. So don't try this nonsense next time. I said you are driving me today. So get your stupid self out there now, for I slap the living daylight out of you. I'm sorry, my queen. My lady said no. And besides, I don't drive my lady. How dare you? Who is she to utter my word? Now get yourself going right now. Are you mad? Is something wrong with you? How dare you? How dare you slap my servant right before me? Is something wrong with your head? Do you want to die? You this cheap harlot. You slapped me! And I'm slapping again and again and again! Hey! Hey! hey. What is going on here? Janet, what is it? Your Majesty. This little brat here sent Gladys on an errand. I told her that my servant cannot go on an errand for her. The next thing she slapped right before me. I remember you offered her a servant. But she rejected her. Why would she then send my on an errand? Is she mad? Jessica, is it true? Stop right there. Your Highness, Your Highness, we need to address this. We need to address this as soon as possible. Because the next time she will try this nonsense with me in this palace, I will pull off my royal regalia and I will beat the hell out of her. Excuse me.
Gente. Welcome, Your Highness. Good afternoon, Ichi. Welcome. Where is your daughter? She's inside. Should I call her? Guard. Go inside and drag her out. Huh? What are you doing? Don't begin now. Your Highness, um, hey, hold it, hold it, dirty pig. Now listen to me very attentively. A toad and a frog may look alike, but a toad is a toad, and a frog is a frog. As you can see, the ugly caterpillar has finally become a beautiful butterfly. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, Jay. Your daughter lacks manners. As a matter of fact, she just grew up. She's not properly raised by her parents. God. My queen. Make sure you flog her to my satisfaction. Ah, okay, my queen. Please. Please. Don't, don't touch me. Please, please your highness. Please, please me, forgive her. Me. Please. Your highness. Please forgive her. Jessica, what is your problem? Why the sudden change in your disposition and character? Why are you always in the middle of any fight that has ever happened since you came into this palace? Why is it so? Why? What, 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 what are you doing? What is she doing? Your Majesty, do not be deceived by these crocodile tears. Your Majesty, I thought you loved and promised to protect me. Now you have joined them to hate me because I'm the smallest and youngest here. You couldn't even ask what happened. You just concluded it's all my fault. <laughs> you know I love you. You don't love me, Your Majesty. Stop lying to yourself. You don't. <laughs> Excuse me, Your Majesty. I beg to take my leave. <laughs> no, 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 I will take did it. You, did you see the way? I'm so ashamed of you, Your Majesty. Oh, I cannot tolerate this kind of messless attitude again. The next time she will try it with me. Oh my goodness. I will drop this. They are roots. Knock, knock. Roots. Are you still sleeping? Roots. Ah, what happened to you? How are you? What happened to you? It's Tochi, Edward's daughter that is now. I warned you. I warned you. To stop picking on her. You know she's in power now. And she can harm you anytime. Oh. You know what she did to her? To provoke her to such anger? Yes, Papa. Ruth here is at fault. I'm saying it before her. She wronged Tochi. Really? Yes, Papa. Ruth. It's all because of the invitation, right? You stood me up. I waited for you. 
Well, I'm sorry. I was not at the palace as at that time. You made me waste my time and the food I prepared for you. What if I, uh, I'll make it up to you? Say, take you out for a treat. Excuse me, my friends. Uh, Can I have a word with you? Your Highness, can we go now? Madam, no year limits. And don't try this next time because you won't like me. My prince, can I have a word with you? Oh, uh, well, okay, okay, okay. Uh, see, uh, I, I will see you. And you. Can we go now? Most definitely, I will keep to my word. Let's go. Um, see, as a matter of fact, I made her a promise to take her out for a treat. A promise made is a promise kept. I will see you when I return, okay? Your Highness. Can we go home now, Your Highness? Yes. What are you fools laughing at? New. I said new. Are you not the one I'm asking? What happened? Why do you want to punish them? Listen, old fool. Stay away from me. As I've been the queen mother of this kingdom, I am also older than your mother. Does it mean she did not teach you how to respect your elders? Sarah, you have just made the biggest mistake of your life. You. What happened? Nothing, Your Highness. We did not do anything to her. And why did she want to punish you? She saw us here and she asked us to kneel down, even after greeting her. You may go back to your duty post. Thank you. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? The Queen Mother. Mother! Can I see her? What did you just do now? Nothing. I just placed my hand to feel the pain of my mother. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
It is deeper than the ocean. Higher than the ground. Where did you take her to? That you are coming back at this time of the night. What are you doing here? Wait a second. Are you monitoring me? Huh? I hope you are not planning to dump me for her. Dump you? Come on, Janet. Or cry it out loud, you and I have fun. And that is it. Nothing more. Okay? Yes, you're beautiful. You are sweet. And I like you. Alright? But you had better not start catching feelings. You're my father's wife. And that will remain forever. And ever. And ever. Excuse me. What are you doing here? Your desire for the throne and that of your father's wives is written all over your face. Yes, you cannot do anything but to steal what you can have. I don't understand. What do you want? To give you what you crave for. The throne. Good morning, Patrick. Patrick, you must stop. What you're trying to do, you're not the one in control. Cripple. If I ever hear my name from your lips again, what I'll do to you, you will not like it. Stop. Evil has taken over the palace. My prince, what do you think we should do? I must see the chief priest. Take me to him. Mm. 
Ah, let's talk. Let's talk. What is it? Um, people might see us. Let's go somewhere else. Yeah, let's see us. Are you afraid of someone seeing us? For crying out loud, someday I will be king. And I will remember this day. Try to do it because it's not going to end and it will never end. You dirty piece of trash. Stay away. I mean, take your dirty smelling ass out of Prince Patrick. He is mine and he will remain mine forever. Don't provoke me. Don't. Oh, never. He is not yes. You're a thief. Stealing from his followers when you should be gracing his majesty's bed. Hmm? No, listen. And listen very, very attentively. You don't know me. <laughs> oh, you want us to expose ourselves? Come on, let us expose ourselves. No. Because I will do that. No, 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 no. no. But you can't do it. I am not as cheap and local as you are. <laughs> I have what they call royalty in me. But don't try me, because if you try me, you won't like what I will do to you. You see, this day, you will surely regret it, if you don't take your time. Oh, Queen Latifah, you will do no such thing. Mm -hmm. You're not even capable of that. You're a cheap slut. You will do not. You will do no such thing. <laughs> I didn't have to exchange words with you. <laughs> but you see, this day, you will surely regret it. It will not end. So, Queen Lati for my food. Come! Piece of slut. Come on. My prince, I am sorry I am not aware of your presence here. It's okay. Can I ask you something? Go on and ask your question, my prince. When you look at the royal family, what do you see? The royal family. I see evil. An untold evil has taken grip of the palace. And you, the custodian of the tradition, is doing nothing about it. And now you My prince. Take me back to the palace. Mother, did you see Prince Patrick? No. But you have not answered my question. Where have you been since home? I've been looking for you. I even heard you went out of the palace. Oh. 
Where did you go to? I was busy, mother. Please, get me something to eat. Okay, I'll call the maid. <laughs> And you are lying comfortably in it. Your Highness, take a look at the door and you'll see it yourself. And what is the meaning of this diabolic act? Excuse me. Now make sure that you clean this nonsense. Is that understood? Who even put it there? Your Highness, Prince Iluchi warned us not to remove it. Are you okay? Have you lost your mind? I asked you to clean something and you're telling me Prince Iluchi said what? Do you want me to kill you? <laughs> I'm sorry, Your Highness. Get lost, get something and clean this place. There must be others in the building. Find them and sweep them out. In fact, make sure you clean the entire building before you sleep this night. Pass you as you open the door. I did not see anything. Be the cause of her death. She was healthy last night. What might have killed her just like that? 
Whatever that killed her did not just kill, but cost her soul as well. Damn it. Can you please show respect to the dead? Are you not? Are you? Is a simple truth a bitter pill for your miserable blood soul to digest? You fool! You call me a fool, Janet. That is who you are. Janet, you are an idiot! You are a fool. Look at this, I show up with that just for one man to do that. You're not ashamed of yourself. You don't have sense, you look out ten. <laughs> Next time I talk you talk, I will deal with you in this palace. Ah, so you make you feel funky. Wake it! Insulting me! You fool! Look at you, look at him. Call it somebody wake it. Do you know who you are? A village slut. And who are you? That does not belong to Roya. And who are you? You don't know anything about Roya. You fool! Get out of this Roya place. Because it's not meant for you. Ah, yes, you fool! You fool! Ah. Mm. This palace is indeed haunted. Oh, I'm talking to talk, 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 talk. Who are you? Fool! You're very stupid. Father, I don't know if you will have chance today. I want you to follow me to the palace. In that you will understand what I have been telling you or what I have just told you. The palace is being haunted by an evil spirit. It's in total disarray now. The palace is on fire. Father, we need help. Well, you could have said so when we are still in the office. But nevertheless, just give me a moment, let me get the Bible and other things, I will start going. Thank you, Father. I'll be waiting. Please, hold on. What is, what is that, what is that moment? <laughs> What is it, Prince Patrick? When are you going to die? When are you going to die and leave this throne for me? Haven't you stayed alive for too long? My Prince, stop it! Don't talk to His Majesty in that manner! Oh if I ever hear your voice again, I'm going to cut off your tongue and feed it to the vultures. Now you talk to your king. Tell him that new dawn is upon you. Enough of this nonsense! Guys! Get him arrested! Oh. Oh. Highness, the prince collapsed. He's unconscious. The prince? Yes. yes my he son. collapsed trying to confront the king himself. I don't know. Please, we need to go and see him. First thing is the mysterious things happening in this palace. Then who gets death? Now, my son. They are not, Your Highness. Nothing will happen to him as far as God is on the throne. Please take me to him. Things we want, 
Ay. It's running temperature. His temperature is very high. You mean Prince Iloji? Yes. Where is he? He might be somewhere in the palace. You want me to send one of his servants to fetch him? No. I'll go to him. But his body. His temperature is very high. I don't want anything to happen to my son. You too should. I've got to come with me, Your Majesty. Stop about him. That what you saw is what you read. That what you saw is what you read. You, who are you? Father, that is my first wife. I do not ask you, Your Majesty. What are you doing in this body? Reveal yourself, evil soul! You shouldn't have interfered in my affair with the wickedness that lived in this royal family. No evil spirits from the pit of hell. You made a mistake choosing the wrong family. Today, I cast you by the oh. name of Jesus. <laughs> I write out your power useless and void of this family. Lose your power in Jesus' name. Lose your power. Lose your power. Lose your power in Jesus' name. Lose your power in Jesus' name. Lose your power. Lose your power in Jesus' name. Before I release you from this body, who are you and what are you doing in this family? When a child writes what is hers, she is that a witch. They took everything from me. I must revenge my death with shame and everlasting tears. Your Highness, you sent for me. Yes. I noticed the way my husband has been looking at you lately. And I can't send you away. But you must make sure you have nothing to do with him. Because if you do, you will regret ever coming into this palace. I will do as you have spoken, Your Highness. I'm only here to serve in order to earn money and take care of my sick mother. I promise I won't fail you. Like you promised. Just keep to it. And I will take care of you. Thank you, Your Highness. You may leave. 
Oh, Malika. Yes. His Majesty demand that you clean up his room. His room? But his room has been tidy up by Ngozi today. Why then are you asking me to do it again? I am not asking you. I'm only passing a message from His Majesty. You can go and ask him yourself. Baba is the king's room like this. Ngozi was supposed to tidy up this room. Ah, this guy is so nice. My dear, you only have one option, and that is to take your clothes off and lie respectfully on that bed. No harm will be done to you. I beg of you, please don't do this. I'm yet to know any man, please. I beg of you. Oh, really? You're yet to know any man? Yes, Your Majesty. That makes it even sweeter. Your Majesty, mm -hmm. please don't do That's this. Even sweeter. Please, Your Majesty. Oh! together. We all have experienced the same fate from the king. Yes, I have as well so had the same fate from the king. Likewise, I. The worst thing is, there's nothing we can do about it. This is our fate. He's the king. He can do as he wants. Stop crying. Though, there are ladies in this palace that enjoy doing it with him. But I, I don't. So please, clean your tears and move on with your life. Please do not take me to your side. I'm from the Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. How many more will you dishonor before you can stop? How many more maidens will you destroy their lives before you can stop, Father? But one thing is certain. Their tears and pains are with the gods. Talk to me again in that manner and I will disown you. What gave you the gods? I have been noticing something for some days now. You have been weak and sick lately. But I will go straight to the point. Are you pregnant and who is responsible? My highness, I'm not pregnant. 
You're not pregnant. Yes, your highness. Okay. Go inside. I will send for the doctor. Okay, your highness. Greetings, Your Highness. Is the result out? Yes, the result is out. She is three weeks pregnant. Go and get rid of it. I died on that day, and no one did anything about it. They moved on with their lives. That's why I saw this person. And I found out that she's the vessel. I needed to avenge my debts. Prince Patrick has been sleeping not only with the maids, but your wives. Hey! This family is cursed, and cursed they shall remain on the surface of the earth. I book you. Ah! Are you die. Ah! Ah! Jesus. Ah! Jesus. Ah! Jesus. Ah! Hey! Aro! Prince Doche. I'm sorry that I came here. But to God be the glory. Always after things we want. Yes, Pascal, everything is going fine. As a matter of fact, the mansion is one of the best in our village. Um, we just need to do some finishing touches. Just give us like two months. Everything will be gone. No, 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 no. Everything is going well. Everybody is fine. <laughs> My God. Ojego one. Ojego and Ayezi. Pascal the Pascal. I can't wait to see you, bro. I can't wait to see you. I can't wait to see you. Pascal. Don't worry, don't worry. It's fine. Trust me. Trust me, the mansion is fine. Alright. Let it do me. I'm so busy. In your corner, corner, hotel. My cheeks are bad. Let it do me. I'm so busy. Corner, hotel. My 
you did like a very good job. I need your test. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Nansu. Yeah. In fact, you are a true friend. Wow! Like oh, thank you so much. Oh, wow! It's beautiful, right? So this is my house. This is your house. Oh, I'm so happy. Wow! Yeah, yes. Just go inside so that you check the interior. Oh, wow. This is cool. Yeah. Yeah. Nice one. Agumba. Agumba. It is said of our fathers that when a dog chooses to die, he fails to perceive the smell of a physis. Yes, Agumba. It is time for you, the heedless fly, to accompany the cops into the grave. According to the custom and tradition of our land that make a ancient kingdom, you and your family had defied the land and had committed great sacrilege. You shall no longer be king over us. What? What? The mantle of kingship shall move to the next family in line, as the custom demands. You and your entire family are hereby banished. Oh my God! Hey! Oh my God! No! 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 no. Except Iloshi, Jessica, you can now return to your family and live a peaceful life. How the mighty has fallen! Agumba, you have just four market days to leave this kingdom. I have spoken the mind and the demand of the gods. No. 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 Your Majesty, you need to do something. Do something! The great people of Amake Ancient Kingdom. I accept my fate. What? Hi! What? And I want to say I am sorry for those that I have wronged. Please forgive me. No, you can't do that. Hi! More words, the more sources, the more life. Hey. Oh no, chiefs of our land, welcome to my new home. Hi, this is heaven and earth. To God be the glory. But wait, this is your friend, Chinos. Did not tell us that you have lost Chiloso. Chiloso is a nice guy. I told him to keep it secret. And he did it exactly the way I wanted. I wanted it to be a shock to all of you. This area. Hey. Uh, uh, um, uh, hello. Uh, um, uh, 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 Pascal, I know um, our copy will be a surprise. If I say I am not surprised, then I'm lying. <laughs> because I know that ever since I grew up in this community, I have never seen the no or the village chiefs in my house before. Uh, maybe you came to celebrate with me on my new mansion. <laughs> uh, uh, Pascal, uh, apart from that, uh, I hope you know what is happening in our kingdom, the recent development concerning the Agumba and his family and the banishment. And uh, according to our tradition and custom, the next family will have to 
you lose uh, the next yes. skill. Oh, God. Oh, no. Once the next skill to the two. Wow. Yes. Now, if you check it by inheritance, you are the first son of this family, which you inherited from your father. And according to the custom, your family is the next in line to produce the next evil, which falls on you. Okay, yes. Wait, 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 wait. I, I, I'm getting confused here. Are you trying to say that mm. the, the kingship of this land now rests in my family? Not just resting in my family, but I have been chosen <laughs> as the next king of this community. Pascal, no one chose you. The gods did. It is according to the tradition and custom of our land. You are the next king of America Kingdom. One does the say shall never end. Uh, please, uh, I'm sorry to disappoint you. I actually came back here to inspect my building hmm. and also to use the opportunity to see people like you that I've not seen for the past months. Do you know the multi billion dollar business I control in the city? And you expect me, Pascal, as a Bunafo, to come down to the village and become the king? What now happened to my business in the city? Who is going to represent my interests over there? I am not interested. Please look for the next family. Um, <laughs> my brother, oh no, uh, he should understand that this is by the design of the gods of the Lord. Ah. Let me ask you, Pastor. Your business is doing well. Why did you choose to return to America Kingdom this particular time? Why? The gods are wise. That is the answer. You. You. They have been protecting you and decided to bring you home now. Yes. That will lead you. Think about it. Hello. My chiefs. I have done consultations. And I have come to the conclusion. I have accepted to become the king, <laughs> but on one condition, I will be operating from the city and also here in the village because of my business. Uh, yeah. uh, Pascal, I must commend you for your brave thinking. Um, I am the know. The chair are always available. The distance will not be a problem. Distance will not be a problem. Thank you, Uno. Thank you, my chiefs. I promise to be visiting the village once every two weeks. Oh. Yeah, us. <laughs> and uh, with strong cabinet members like you. I don't think there will be a problem. No, there will be a problem. It is a call from my people. And I don't have a choice than to accept it. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I will leave us also... up. Ah. Just yes. us will not get back. At all. <laughs> At all. Um, um, we must thank you. You've done well. You've proven once again that you are really the son of the son. In this case, in the chain, you have to start preparing. Yeah? Uh, all those uh, business partners, those billion billion, <laughs> start inviting them. <laughs> because if I get me, <laughs> uh, your coronation will come very soon. Huh? Get Thank prepared. you very much. Thank you, my chiefs. Thank you, no. Doshi. Sir. What are you doing here? I came to see you, sir. I, I thought you were banished from this village. Yes. 
They, they gave us eight days to leave. But I still have two more days. That's why I came to see you to talk with you. Besides, right. sit. Can I just sit? Yeah, sit down. Mm. Okay. Uh, so, Dutch. Sir? What can I do for you? I first of all I you you have a very beautiful house. <laughs> Thank you. And God I really bless you. You got a glory. I came to see you and please and uh, for what I've done to you in the past. I'm really really sorry about everything. I'm so sorry. I learned that uh, you were the king, the next king of this land. So I came to talk with you. You, you know, in the past, you told me that you loved me, that you want me to be your queen. So, as the next king of this land, I know that. You need a strong and experienced queen by your side that will also help you to get to a higher level. Like they said, behind every successful man, there is a woman. And not just a woman, a strong woman. And because of that, I came to talk with you and accept me back into your life as your next queen of this land. Only grateful. Wow, that's so thoughtful of you. Yes, you know, um, Dochi, I have always admired your zeal and determination to be successful in life. You've always wanted to be a queen and live in the royal house. And I can still see that the dream is still in you. That's good. Uh, wait a minute. Check out me. Check out Yes, Um, 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 Tochi, meet Chikori, my wife, and the next queen of this land. What's that? Pass them. To God. Don't you? The lady I told you about. Don't you? Thank you for making me meet Pasta. He's such a good sense. Hi. And without you, I wouldn't have met him at all. Yes. So, thank you. Hi! Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Peace, peace. Don't die you have just two days to leave this community. Don't tell me! After 20, you will go. Yes, I am. I'm not going to be a woman. I'm not going to be a woman. I'm not going to be a woman. It is deeper than the ocean. Higher than the mountains. Oh, be a woman. I'm not going to be a woman. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, why no be way? Come to the family by It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. No be way. Come to the family by Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? I wanna be there. It is deeper than the ocean. 
Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one or be way. I'm new if family by you. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. Oh, be way. I'm new if family by you. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one or be way. Come to the family by you. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. No big way. Come to the family by you. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one or be way. I'm new if family by you. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. Oh, be way. I'm new if family by you. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one or be way. Come to the family by you. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. Go oh, be way. Come to the family by you. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? I wanna be there. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. I'll be there. I'll be there. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one or be way. I'm new if family by you. It is deeper than the ocean, higher than the mountains. Oh, be way. I'm to leave family by you. Can you tell me what to say? Can you tell me what to do? Oh, one or be way. I'm to leave family by you. It is deeper than the ocean, 
Higher than the mountains, go be way down to the very bad. Ooh. Ah.